Well, the help is wonderful. It's a chance for people to not go so far away if they don't have a car. Poverty isn't just people living under a bridge or living on the street. Poverty now is multiple families living within a household, multiple families living off of one income. That's the poverty we're seeing. Yes, they're sheltered. Yes, they have you know certain utilities and certain income, but it's not enough to really bring the family forward. What all these events are is really an outreach to the citizens of Adams County uh, to make these services more available to them in, in a friendly, uh, beautiful environment. It's got things that my son and I could use for mental health, for food stamps, for the housing, and right now we're, in, we're needing some of those resources. I think it's nice and that they can kind of offer these to us. Me hace conveniente porque muchas veces uno va y pierde mucho tiempo allá y nomás arregla una cosa y así arregla uno varias cosas. This brings everybody together in an open forum, in an open format. People can find out where this help is available. It's incumbent upon Adams County to supply this and give this information, especially in our key areas of population. It's too far for me to go other places. Programs like food assistance, Medicaid, Colorado Works. And it's just convenient and it's nice to see that the resources are here in the neighborhood. The first time in a long time I think that we've pulled together a collaborative of agencies uh, and it turns out a lot of the families that we're seeing in one program area are also being served by one of the nonprofits or the faith-based community or the food bank. It's tying people together. We have to be able to address the new poverty. Es mucha ayuda.